WYMT Mountain Sports, your home for the Kentucky Wildcats and local high school sports. The Moorhead State baseball team continues a record-breaking season. The Eagles are 36-20 and, and in the winner's bracket final of the Ohio Valley Conference Tournament tonight. Let's head down to Jackson, Tennessee. Two-seeded Moorhead State taking on six-seeded Belmont in the semifinals. And when you're playing in the semifinals, you're going to do anything it takes. Ryan Kent makes the catch to get the out. Belmont, though, still up 3-2 to the sixth inning. Alex Stevens. See you later. He went three for five with three RBI. Moorhead State wins it 8-4, goes to its first OVC baseball title game since 1996. MSU will play the winner of Belmont and Southeast Missouri. Five-game losing streak for the Cincinnati Reds during Cleveland for a three-game weekend set. Bottom two, Mike Leak. Well, that's not good. He walks Michael Bourne. Problem is not the walk, but the fact that the bases are loaded because he walked three others. Or run scores. We're tied at one. Next batter, Jason Kipnis. Come on in another run. 2-1 Indians. Top three. Same score. Todd Frazier. All right, the Reds got some hope. Lines one to left. 24th RBI for Frazier as Brandon Phillips comes in to score. We're tied at two apiece. Back to Leak, though. In the third, Brandon Moss, bye. Leak goes four innings, allows seven hits, five runs. As you see right here, bottom four got worse. It was Moss again. He went two for four on the day, a homer, a double. Reds lose their sixth straight game. Meanwhile, the softball Cats get things started down in Gainesville tomorrow afternoon against Florida. Third straight year, Kentucky has been to the Super Regionals of the NCAA Tournament. First pitch. 1 p.m. Eastern time. It's a best of three series. All games televised on ESPNU. The Gators are the number one overall seed in the tournament. American Pharoah on the track at Churchill Downs this week. Another morning gallop Friday in prep for the Belmont Stakes in New York. The Derby and Preakness winner got in a little more than a mile today. After winning the Preakness, the Colt came back to Louisville rather than going straight to New York for the Belmont. That's because everyone in the American Pharoah camp prefers to stay at Churchill Downs. I'd prefer to train here. We're set up here. Our barn's here. Um, yeah, I mean, New York's all right, but some, you know, it's a big track, uh, sandy track. You get a lot of weather there as you get here, but uh, we're more comfortable here. Every time a LeBron G James team has gone up 2-0 in a best of seven series, his team does not lose. 14-0 in his career when going up 2-0 in a best of seven. The Atlanta Hawks trying to avoid going 2-0 to bronze, bronze Cleveland Cavaliers tonight. Eastern Conference Finals game two in the ATL. Early first quarter, Bron Bron. Step back buckets. Later in the quarter, Cavs by two, Bron Bron. Now working it in the paints. He was 10 of 22 with 30 points on the night. Second quarter, Cavs up by five. J.R. Smith finds him on the other end. That's easy, might want to get back, Hawks. All right, Cleveland by five, under four to go in the half. That's Dennis Schroeder with a splash ball, but the Hawks didn't have enough splash balls to win this game in the second half. They only scored 33 points after the break and lose by 12. Cavs up now 2-0 in the series, Steve. Yikes. Like I said, anytime a LeBron James team goes up 2-0, you lose the series. He's undefeated 14-0. Now they got to go back to Cleveland for the next two games. All right, Jamie, thank you very much. We'll be right back.